Today we're going to be breaking down all of the numbers and risk factors with a single family home in a B-class neighborhood. A motto, this is your video, let's dive in. Price. I mean, this is actually a really nice house. A little bit more rough, a little more ragged. It's gonna keep those values high. Here's quarter mile comps. There's $260,000 houses right down the street. You'll be able to put your offer through me, and then after you close, Holden Wise, we can handle the property management. We'll even be able to help you with the insurance. We have lenders who will write loans for investors in all 50 states. This deal is 100% James Wise approved. James Wise denied. Hey, real estate investors, welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show here on Holton Wise TV. I'm your host, James Wise. Behind the scenes, we got Tommy cutting up the footage. Now, today's show, this is for a client of mine, Amato. Amato, you used to live in Cleveland. You're currently residing in Tampa, Florida. And this is the second video you've got for me. In the previous video that I did for you, uh, we were looking at a multi-family property in a c-class neighborhood i thought there was some hidden value there and uh after that video came out and you and i went back and forth uh you know we determined we were going to utilize your second video to shift gears a little bit get something a little bit simpler that also has a little bit less risk and you opened up the idea uh, of going with a single family home so we can take a, a relatively similar amount of money but get us something a little bit less risky a little bit more stable and that's what we've done that's what I found for you today uh, so let's get right into your property that I found 21800 Tracy Avenue Euclid Ohio 44123 I love Euclid uh, they just recently put an Amazon Fulfillment Center. There was a, a, a long abandoned mall, which I'm sure you're aware of because you used to live in Cleveland. Long abandoned mall. They tore that thing down. They put up a fulfillment center, an Amazon Fulfillment Center right there. Uh, we are very, very close to that uh, with this particular property. Dude, just tons of jobs, man. A few thousand jobs got put right in there. And these are the jobs that we want to have out of our tenant base, right? These are $15 an hour minimum, right? Amazon doesn't hire anybody else, uh, doesn't hire anybody for anything less than $15 an hour, right? So these are the types of properties that those folks are going to want and can afford. So it's just a solid working class tenant base. Now, this property has been listed by Keller Williams Brokerage 35 days ago for $74,000. Well, they actually listed it for higher. They just recently reduced the price. So 35 days ago, they listed it for $75,000. They just recently reduced it to $74,000 because it hasn't sold. Let's take a look at the photos. Just a nice little brick bungalow, okay? The yard's looking a little rough, but that's okay. Um, this kitchen, this is what I really like. This is really nice, actually. Uh, we got to clean this thing up. We're going to have to spend a little bit of money on uh, making, sprucing this up, you know, fresh paint, get rid of that nasty carpeting, uh, fill it with, uh, you know, refinish the hardwoods, you know, just make it look nice. But this this kitchen, we're not going to need to do too much here, right? These cabinets, these are nice, nice little countertop, little for micro countertop. That is perfect for what we want to do. Um, so all in all, it's going to need a little bit of cosmetic love, but it's looking pretty good. Like this carpet, it's looking, uh, you know, a little, a little dirty. So we're going to really spruce this bad boy up. Now, if we do that, I anticipate we'll be able to rent this 3-2 bungalow for $1,050 a month or $12,600 a year. And as far as price goes, they've listed it. Uh, 75. They just recently reduced it to 74. I think we need to come in a little bit lower than that. I anticipate we should be able to close this out around $70,000. So that's what I've broken down the numbers. I think we're going to want to try to close this at approximately $70,000, and we're going to want to spend approximately $6,000 making this thing cosmetically beautiful. Now, per the notes of the listing agent, the sellers are actually going to provide a clear point of sale 
unlike your last property I did for you, uh, where there was no point of sale because it was in Cleveland proper, Euclid has a point of sale process. If you're not sure or not familiar or anyone else watching Amato's video who has no idea what the point of sale violation process is like in the Cleveland market, there's several suburbs that have it. So in the show notes, I created a little highlight video where I discuss the point of sale process. So anybody who wants to learn about what the point of sale process is should check out that video because if you're going to invest in the Cleveland market, you need to know this because a huge portion of the B-class suburbs and the C-class suburbs utilize this point of sale process. For you, Amato, not a big deal, not nothing you need to worry about right now because the seller is going to provide that free and clear. And so that leaves our whole renovation budget just to cosmetically make this thing look beautiful. Like I said, let's get let's pull those carpets. Let's go with the nice hardwoods, refinish them. We'll get a nice clear coat over them so if dogs or kids, you know, pee, spill stuff on the floor, uh, you're not going to have to worry about that at, at continuing turnovers. We're going to spend the money one time right up front, get rid of carpet just so you have those hardwoods. Harden your asset. I'd like to go agreeable gray. Uh, throughout the entire space. The kitchen floor looked okay. I just think we're going to need to clean that stuff up. So 6000 um, is a pretty fair estimate. Now, of course, you're going to want to make your offer contingent on a third-party home inspection, appraisal, and then before we put a tenant in, of course, the Holton Wise maintenance staff is going to want to check everything else too. So I'm sure there's going to be other little knick-knack items that pop up, like maybe there's not an appropriate amount of smoke detectors, you know, just minor, minor stuff like that, right? So I think 6000 is a pretty fair estimate. Now, as far as spending approximately 76000 which is what I think we'll need to spend, what's that going to look like, okay? We're bringing in 1050 in rent. Repairs and maintenance, we're going to budget 52. Vacancy and non-payment, we're going to budget 52. Cap expense, we're going to budget 52. Nothing in this particular property from a capital expenditure uh, standpoint is brand new. So you got stuff that's like, you know, mid midlife, right? So big ticket items, things that you're going to need to always save money to factor in. We got one furnace in this property. So unlike a multifamily property, you only got one furnace to worry about. You're going to spend approximately $3,000 every 30 years replacing furnaces. Hot water tanks, you only have one to worry about because it's a single family home. You're going to spend approximately $1,000 replacing a hot water tank, and you're going to need to do that approximately every 15 years. Roof, this is probably a $5,000 roof, and you're going to need to replace those every 30 years. So after the home inspection comes back, you'll know the exact ages of these mechanical items. But again, this property is not priced in a way that you should anticipate these items are new. Uh, they're going to be mid to end of life. And, of course, you're going to need to factor in spending the money to replace those when the time comes. But that's all okay. That is all being factored in, and this price point still makes sense. So with all of that stuff considered, if we could pick it up for 70 that would be great. As far as taxes, 165 a month. Insurance, that should run you 80 Click the show notes below. Anybody watching this who's interested in lowering their insurance premium we own a farmer's franchise and we only handle rental properties all 50 states you want to lower your premium check that out water sewer should be approximately 75 bucks a month you as the landlord got to pay for that if you are curious to know why i want you to go to the holtonwise.com and click the property management fact we give you guys a whole breakdown of why that is it's a it's a whole bureaucratic mess but that fact will explain it Lawn care, this is what's great about single family homes. Zero, right? We've put zero on the chart here. Now, don't get me wrong. When the property's vacant, right? If you have the property vacant for like two months during the summer, yeah, you're going to have to pay us 33 bucks a time to go out there and cut it. But once we get a tenant in there, unlike a multifamily property, you don't have to pay us to cut it. The tenant is going to be the one who's handling all of the lawn care. You're not going to need to spend any money on that. In addition, property management, even though... We're getting $1,050 a month in rent. The property management is capped at 100 So when you buy nicer assets, lower risk assets, for us as property managers, they're less work. So we reward you, okay? We reward you by capping it at $100 a unit. So for us, a $1,050 a month single family home tenant is a lot less work than a $650 C-class duplex tenant. So we reward you guys for buying nicer assets. Helps pencil things out in your returns. So we should anticipate spending approximately 
five seventy six a month running this property, which would bring you an NOI of approximately four seventy four a month or five thousand six hundred eighty eight a year. Of course, you don't get to put all that in your pocket because you want to finance this. Why wouldn't you? It's the best thing to do when you're investing in real estate. So, if you pick it up at seventy. We're going to estimate that you're going to spend about 6 k up front getting this thing beautiful so we get a top-of-the-line tenant. Your NOI, 474 a month. That's a cap rate of 7.5. Your mortgage down payment is 17500 you got a small mortgage, man, 52500 Your payment is teeny tiny. It's only 266 a month. So that means after you pay off that teeny tiny mortgage, you're going to be bringing home in your pocket 208 a month on average or almost $2,500 a year. Now, that's an average. Every single year is not going to be the same. Some years are going to make more. Some years are going to make less. And remember, with you taking home that almost $2,500 a year, that is still, with me anticipating, you are putting $52 a month in your pocket. Every single month, you are putting that in your pocket. You're not considering that part of your return, even though you get to keep it when there's no CapEx, right? You're not buying a new roof, uh, new furnace, new hot water tank for many years, right? That only happens once every 15 or 30 years. So that 52 that I'm factoring in, you're just saving up for that big ticket expense. So that's not even being calculated in as your return, but that's, that's really going in your piggy bank. Same thing with your repairs and maintenance. The majority of the repairs and maintenance, they come at turnovers, right? Like right now, I want you to spend six Gs, okay? Making this thing freaking beautiful and hardening it. But after that... You're probably not going to have any repairs for a long time, and then your next turnover should be a lot cheaper because one of the main things I want you to do, a decent chunk of that budget, I want you to spend it on the floors, right? You do that because if you put a tenant in this, they live there for three years, maybe they got a couple kids running around, there's no scenario where that cream carpet or a lighter color carpet or even like a darker color carpet is probably not going to hold up to multiple tenants, dude. We need to make these properties like crisp and clean and fresh when tenants go to move into them, right? So, you know, if you got carpet, folks are going to move out and that carpet's trash, basically, man. You got to replace it. But if we refinish the hardwoods and seal them, that's it, man. That's one and done. You don't got to worry about it again. So that's why I want you to spend so much up front. All of that factored in, this property should bring you a cash on cash return of 10%. 0.62%, which checks off all of the boxes that you had in your investment goals. That is what is cool when you guys buy multiple investment uh, analysis videos from me. So anybody else, just so you know, you go to HoltonWise.com, click the property search tab, and then you go to the MLS search and analysis show right here. These are all of the MLS search and analysis products. In addition, you can go all the way to the bottom. If you don't want to spend a few hundred dollars getting a personalized product from me, you could spend 30 bucks, and we will match your risk tolerance and the asset type you want uh, with what is available in the Cleveland market and match it up to the ultimate guide to grading Cleveland neighborhoods. So before I did the first video with the model, he was really gung-ho on C-class multifamily. You can get a feed. If you think you're a person who wants C-class multifamily, you get a feed from us for 30 bucks for all the C-class multifamily properties. Anytime a C-class multi multifamily property pops up on the market, you will know about it before anybody else, before Zillow, before Trulia, before Realtor.com. It's my direct broker access. But like I said, Amato did two videos, and I was able to, you know, we were able to go back and forth and really see what he really wants. And then we swift, you know, we switched gears a little bit. Now he's like, you know what, B-class single family would be pretty great. So that's why we did the second video. That's why I like when you guys do multiple videos. We get to really, you know, get in depth. I get to push out what's going on with what you thought you liked, and then I get to take feedback from you and make adjustments as necessary like we did today. And, of course, if you decide that you know B-class single families is what you like, we, of course, have a B-class single family feed, so you don't need to waste your time filtering through single family homes that are not B-class. You don't want to look at stuff that's more risky or waste your time looking at stuff that's A-class, which isn't going to pencil out with as nice of a return. So that's why those are a great starter pro product in conjunction with the analysis products. And one more thing, too, just so you guys know, you can also bid on properties by watching the Investment Properties for Sales show 
Um, you'll want to subscribe to the mailing list. We email that show to you every single day at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Those are the properties we here at Holton Wise are selling. We are the number one seller of investment properties in the Cleveland market. In addition, we are bringing you guys properties from other markets, uh, Mississippi, Memphis, Tennessee, Alabama, Indianapolis, Detroit. We have vendors in all of these markets who are doing the property management themselves. So we're allowing you guys to get the opportunity to bid on their properties as well. That's all I've got for you today. As always, I'm James Wise with Holton Wise, and this is Real Estate Investing Made Easy. For the price, I mean, this is actually a really nice house. A little bit more rough, a little more ragged. It's going to keep those values high. Here's quarter mile comps. There's $260,000 houses right down the street. You'll be able to put your offer through me, and then after you close, holding wise, we can handle the property management. We'll even be able to help you with the insurance. We have lenders who will write loans for investors in all 50 states. This deal is 100% James Wise approved. James Wise denied. Discount Property Warehouse, founded by real estate visionary Robert Thiel, author of The Short Term Retirement Program, is a complete turnkey solution for acquiring cash flowing investment properties in Memphis, Tennessee. Our turnkey properties include a third party home inspection, new HVAC with 10-year warranties, new dimensional roofs, competitive price to rent ratios, discounted property insurance, in-house property management, private financing, and much more. At Discount Property Warehouse, we have a staff of licensed agents standing by, ready to assist you with every aspect of the process. Call us today or visit us online at discountpropertywarehouse.com. Cleveland, Ohio is widely considered to be one of the top rental markets in the entire United States. This is because here in Cleveland, our housing prices are low and our rental prices and demand are high. At Holton Wise, we provide the complete turnkey solution for all real estate investors, whether they are local, out of state, or even abroad. As real estate brokers, we will provide you with agent representation to help you buy properties ranging from single family homes to large apartment complexes. We even have referrals for lenders who can provide investment property loans to investors located in all 50 states, allowing you to capitalize on the use of leverage or other people's money. We have referrals to top-notch title companies so you know that all of your transactions are safe and secure, with every single property being delivered to you with clear title. Once you close on the property, we have an investor-focused insurance brokerage who can handle all your property insurance needs. This insurance brokerage handles auto, home, life, and business policies, but they specialize in working with policies for landlords. We also have full service property management. We can handle all rental property advertisements, tenant placement, rent collection, evictions, maintenance, landscaping, construction, and repairs. In addition, Holton Wise also offers digital media and education. One day, when you are ready to sell your investment, Holton Wise, as the number one seller of investment properties in the greater Cleveland area, can market your property in a video just like this one to our worldwide base of investors who are looking to capitalize on the high cash flow opportunities in the Cleveland, Ohio market. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our latest content including video tours and analysis of investment properties that are available for sale, real estate investment education, and our most interesting encounters with tenants from hell. Holton Wise, real estate investing made easy.